Father, you shouldn't be here. You were a priest? You seen this before? If you know anything, you need to tell me. Something like this happen. Faith can be a dangerous thing. Finally, our own place. Wow. I love it. So this is where you're gonna do it? In between unpacking boxes and moving into this shithole? Yeah. Hey. Wait, you at least brought them, right? Parents' rings? Heavy. It's meaningful. It's cheap. You still like them. I still get to be your best man, though, right? Shut up. Hey, come on!
shine low when I walk so slow. Anna Wallen Thompson. Will you marry me? Anna? You don't want to get married? You don't love me? No, I, I do love you, Tyler. Tell me. I don't know. I, it's stupid. And I just can't. Hey, did you see Anna? Yeah, she went that way. What's up? I don't know. Do you want to talk about it? Thank God, because feelings, I'm just gonna go. Oh, uh, wait, 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 um, uh, uh, I, thanks for all the help, I, I really appreciate it. Are you kidding me? 20 bucks? If you wanna give me your money, bring it on Friday Night Poker, or at least be prepared to offer way more than that. 20 bucks is just insulting. I made you rethink our entire relationship. Asshole. Fine, but when I take all your money. Please, candy from a baby. I'm so sorry. I... Don't be sorry. You have nothing to be sorry for. I wasn't expecting it. We never talked about it. I guess I'm I'm not ready for it. For marriage. I I completely understand. No, no just, just let me, okay? Mom got married really young. She was 21 and pregnant with me. She was so angry. Angry at her choices. Angry at me. Angry at the whole world. I don't want to be like my mother, Tyler. It won't happen to you. But it might. I get it. I understand. I do. We should have talked about it. I love you, Tyler. Just... We can still be in love and not married, right? Not yet. I like not yet.
for sleep. No, no, hurry up and get dressed now. Go, quick, 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 quick. We need to get to St. Andrews and introduce ourselves before Mass starts. Remember, we said we wanted to go to church with you still. Well, here we are. We just want to see you get settled. And meet the priest. It's very important to make a good first impression. Grandparents are here. Oh, my gosh. What is going on here? Tyler? I'm so sorry about that. Tyler didn't tell me you guys were stopping by this morning. Would you like some coffee? Tyler, what is going on? We moved in together. Tyler, you know your grandfather's a deacon. How is this going to look? I don't know how you were brought up, but Tyler knows right from wrong. Grandpa, it's not a big deal. Other churches have no problem with this. Not the Catholic Church. You knew it was wrong, and you willingly chose to do it anyway. Tyler, how could you do this to us after all we've done? He's a grown man. He can do what he wants. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sins like this are gateways to worse. Do you want to follow in your brother's footsteps? Your grandmother and I will not watch you invite evil into your life. How you doing? You know, when my parents died, my grandparents took us in, me and Brian. Mm -hmm. They raised us and they loved us. They're old fashioned, but it, just disappointing them. It makes me feel like a bad person. You're not a bad person. You're a good guy. You're my guy. You wanna go inside and clean this denison? Too soon? Yes. <laughs> Come on.
Babe, come here and let me try and cleanse your aura. <laughs> All that guilt's got it muddy and gross. I have a gross aura. What's the smell too? Come on, you know I don't believe in that stuff. I know, but maybe it'll make you feel better. Come on, come here. <sighs> okay. Thanks for making it in. Yeah, sure. They added another module to the Thompson project. Yeah, sorry. Uh, the move took a lot longer than expected. So, the changes need to be done ASAP. And no fuck ups this time. Okay? I'm looking for Tyler Iski. Tyler? What's going on? Tyler, I'm Father Shaw. I realize this is a bit awkward, but I need to speak with you about something. I am so sorry about this. I did not think they would stoop to this. Look, we're not interested in anything you have to say. I know my grandparents mean well, but uh, this, this has is... nothing to do with your grandparents. It's very important. May I please just have a few minutes of your time? 
please come in. As religions go, Catholicism has a fairly bloody reputation, probably because it was founded in such a dark age. And it's ironic because the original point of the church was to bring light into the darkness, but all births begin in blood, so the Heavenly Father must have a plan for us. Um, Father Shaw, I, I want to be honest with you. I'm just not a practicing Catholic right now. I guess I've broadened my horizons. Um, I just don't believe in it anymore. That's the problem, don't you see? At one time you did believe. As a child, you believed. And your belief made it real. In your mind, in your body, even your DNA. Belief changes reality. You think this is all mystical bullshit. No, it's science, quantum physics, string theory. Hell, in a few years, it'll probably be the new gospel. But now, as the church begins to understand it, we begin to realize the danger we've put our followers in. It's our fault, I admit. The church has so many secrets, so much guilt, that this new blood on our hands should seem like nothing, but it's an evil, a power much like a virus. And we've all been infected, those of us who believe or have believed. We call it corrupter. Would you like cream or sugar with your coffee? Black, please. Even in the Bible, it says, when I was a child, I spoke as a child. I reasoned as a child. But when I became a man, I put childish things away. The things I believed as a child have no bearing on my life now. Of course they do. Think. What commandments are you breaking right now? Honor thy mother and thy father fornication. Listen, are you trying to say that I'm going to hell just for breaking a few minor laws in a religion that was created in humanity's dark ages? At one time you believed. Now you don't. All the things you believed in as a child, the Holy Spirit, the Virgin Mary, communion, demons, the devil, you made those things real. You accepted the laws. Honor thy father and thy mother. Have no gods before him. Do not commit adultery, and you abided by them. Thusly, you were protected by them. Protected from the darkness, from evil. Those laws, you can be punished for breaking them, even now, even though you say you don't believe. It all still applies. It's ridiculous. It's time for you to leave. water on you. We should call the cops. No. He's just a crazy old man. Probably not even a priest. Do you really think your grandparents sent him? <sighs> Maybe. <sighs> I'm so creeped out right now. <sighs> You're my big strong protector.
haven't seen any true signs yet, but my instincts tell me that this is the one. We need someone down here to watch this kid. Can I come in? No. I'm afraid not. Where's Grandpa? He's taking a nap right now. Well, wake him up, because I'm not leaving until we talk about Father Shaw. I think he said something crazy about a virus or an entity or something. I couldn't sleep last night because of it. I told you, we know nothing about a Father Shaw. Maybe St. Andrew sent him. I understand their priest keeps a close eye on his parishioners. How would they have known if you or Grandpa didn't tell them? We told no one. I don't need people staring at me after Mass and whispering behind my back. I went through that already with your brother. Brian. He was gay. Not a pervert. And you and Grandpa were wrong to kick him out. We were thinking of you. And now you have to decide what's more important. That girl or your immortal soul. Her name is Anna, and I love her. And I don't give a damn about my immortal soul. Mary? Fuck, I am... I am so, so sorry!
What the fuck? Is going on. Mary said you attacked her by the copier? Oh, that was an accident. I didn't mean to. Stop. Just stop it. Get back to work. If it wasn't for the Thompson Project, you'd be cleaning out your desk. Come in. What are you doing? Do you have to burn that shit in here? What? You're clinging to this fake religion. Mom wasn't exactly the best example of how to be. What are you talking about? She teaches you that marriage is a prison. When in fact, it's the only pure way, truly pure way, Together. Babe, I don't understand. Being willing to live together without being married. You're kind of acting like a real whore right now.
Tyler, what's going on? Babe, is this still about last night? I'm sorry about the incense. Hey. What's happening? What are you doing out here? What time is it? Shit! Tyler, we need to talk about last night. Now that you've slept on it. Uh, well, I've overslept, so I need to go, but let's talk about it tonight, okay? No. Tyler, what's going on? Nothing. I haven't been sleeping well since we moved in. Been having these dreams. No, I mean, why? God damn it. I got it. Just go.
Tyler! My office. Now. You look like you need a drink. I know a good place. Look at these photos. A young bride on her wedding day, dressed in white like a virgin. But she wasn't a virgin. Possessed by the virus, the, the entity we call Corruptor, she killed herself and her unborn child. He shall stalk the lost sheep down to the last lamb. Vere e asuske anum vnevitu. Tyler, did you take Latin in college? No. We need to get to your house immediately. I, I can prepare you for the exorcism there. <laughs> you knew her. She meant something to you. Personally. Water. I need water here right now. This is Shaw. I witnessed two of the three signs. He didn't tell me you guys were going out tonight. I think it'll be real good for him. I think all of this has got him stressed out. Well, yeah, moving in and the work. I'll speak of the devil. Hey, I'm starting to think you were going to blow me off. What? Shit. You did forget. Well, it's poker night, bitch, and I'm here to take all your money. Come on, let's go. How'd you know where the other ace was? Man, this is bullshit! Oh, Alright, it's just a lucky streak. 
Come on. Let's take a break. Let's go. So, anything you want to tell me? Nothing? Tyler, what the fuck? Talk to me! Eric? Yeah? Uh... I don't... I don't know. Losing a lot of sleep lately. Can't. You're not leaving. They give us a chance to win our money back. Dude, it's like you know what we're holding. Fucking bullshit! How are you doing? Are you helping him? No, it's just a lucky streak, that's all. I don't like it. I don't like it, and I don't like you. Oh! To call the cops. What the fuck is going on? Please, help me, please, 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 help me, help me. Fuck. Okay. Okay. Let's okay. go.
are you guys? I'm supposed to be at work. I don't know where he is, do you? I dropped him off here last night. You sure he's not in the house? Tyler! What did you guys do last night? Just played poker with the guys. He's gotta be here somewhere. Tyler! understand. He's freezing. We should take him to a hospital. Whoa. Listen, I didn't want to tell you, but last night he drank a lot. Like, a lot. This is all my fault? Let's just give him some space. I'll stay here with him. You go to work. All right. I'll, I'll find someone to cover my shift. Wake up, asshole. Good news. I just came from the hospital. Dean's alive. But he's gonna be pressing charges, so... Shit.
please just listen to me. You're in terrible danger. What are you doing here? You can't go home. Has Tyler shown any examples of unexpected strength? Tell me. I can't make the call until all three conditions are met. All the mass murders you read about, the normal citizens who suddenly snap and massacre their families, neighbors, their co-workers in the most violent way possible, they all begin like this. You are so lost that you think it's just the human condition. You have never known true belief. An innocent heart is like food to the demonic horde. And Corrupter wants nothing more than to turn our belief against us. To destroy us for willing it into existence. You're crazy. I believe that Tyler is Corrupter's next victim. But I can't help him unless I'm sure. What did you do to Tyler? I'm trying to save him. I'm in the kitchen. I made it fresh for you. Anything from Shaw? No. How about the beeper? <sighs> no one uses the beeper anymore. I miss the beeps. Check again. Still nothing.
I can't see from here. You? Grandma? Hi, it's Tyler. <coughs> Tyler? <coughs> don't hang up, don't hang up! Tyler? Tyler? Anna and I broke up. Can you and Grandpa come over this evening? I'm real sad about it.
wanted to help me? I listen. I couldn't listen. I was sorry. I'm so sorry. He wouldn't stop. He wouldn't leave me alone. I don't want to listen to him. Didn't. I had to do those things. What? What did you do? Everything. Uh. Uh. She is the cause of all your sins. Tyler, please. I thought we were happy. Do you, brother, take her to be your wife by the laws of God? I do. And does she take you to be her husband by the laws of God? She does. You made me do this, Anna. You made me. We need to leave. And no, we have to find him. Tyler? We need to call the police. I'm 
I'm sorry. I didn't know. I opened the door and it came in. She knows your sins. All of them. too late. We can help you. Like you help me, grandfather? No. Shut up! You did this to him! I stood by and let you. I was thrown out. Spoiled meat. Spoiled meat. In so much pain. So much pain. No, Tyler. No. Brian. Brian, please forgive me. No, George. Tyler, you're your grandfather. Punished for his sins. Brian knows, Grandma. He knows everything. We did our best for you boys after your parents died. Brian, he was beyond saving. You always said to hate the sin and love the sinner. He refused treatment. Did he tell you that? Brian refused our help. We would have done anything for you boys. Anything. Turning him out was the last thing we could think of. Oh, we were so afraid of what people would say. Oh, Tyler, I'm so sorry. It is just an arsehole with anger issues. You fucked up. As soon as you pulled that trick with the door, we knew. You're too late. My brother and I are doing good work here. It's not your brother. It's Corrupter. He's just another fuck demon. And we're here to destroy him. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Come here. Come here.
let the enemy have no power over him. He's finished. He can withstand no more. have to be the sin eater. I think you should take a turn now and again. Did we get him? Not all of them. Uh, fuck up, fuck up! Uh, 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 about the boy? Grandma took him before our guys could get there. I don't suppose we can call this one a win, then, can we? It's all about the balance. Ah, balance. 